Hello guys, it's Nice I'm back with another Pokemon Black 2 White 2 Wi-Fi battle and today I'm going to bring you guys a UU battle. Yes, but before that I am actually going to give a shout out to my friend which is Kevin Kingdra. So, um he did a new background to my channel, you can go check it out in my channel, just go to my page and you'll see it. Um it is now on the screen as well as you can see. He is really cool. I told him what I wanted and he did it on Photoshop. So, um, please go subscribe to him, because I am sure that if you ask it, he will do a background or an icon for you, because he is a really nice guy, and he likes to do it, so just ask politely to him and subscribe to him, I'm, that I am sure it will do it. Um, and, um, today, I'm going to bring you guys a battle, which was against a friend of mine, which is Mystical. His channel link will be down, the, down below in the description as well, so please go subscribe to him. Yes, I was on Skype, well, not really, I was on Smogon Finder, and I saw there his request, and I, he was on Skype, so I asked him on Skype if he wanted to battle, and he said, sure, why not, um, the, um you wanted RU or UU, we end up for doing UU. Yes, so in my team I have the Life Orb Mian Chao, the um, Expert Melternator, Special Defensive Umbreon, Specs Shaman, Choice Scarf Dermanitan, and um, Evil Light Glager Defensive. In his team, the biggest threats are obviously going to be the Mian Chao, um, that Power Flinch um, Togekis with Serene Grace. His um, Dermanitan is going to be a pain if it is Scarf, because then I cannot outspeed him with my Shaman and go for the Earth Power. Um, Yomomomola is going to be an Omomomola. Oh my god. Olomom. Oh, what? Olomomola. Yeah, that's it. Nido King and Swampert. I don't want him to have Stealth Rocks up because I obviously don't have a spinner. And that will hurt my Dermanitan. Yes, oh, uh, and with that being said, I think we can now go straight into the battle. So, as we have seen from the team preview, he is going to rough with his Mian Xiao, as I am going to lead off my own Mian Xiao. I go for the fake out and I try to win the speed tie as he actually switches into um Swampert. Um it does a um, good chunk the fake out thinking he is defensive. Go for the eye jump KP because it is stab life orb, it should be able to kill it, but now he lives with a smidgen and he's going to be able to kill me off with the waterfall. Yeah, that's bad because now my biggest threat or one of my threats is out of the way. And I now go into my Tornadoes and I U-turn because I knew it would kill. And if and if he wanted to switch out, I will have the advantage. Now I'm going to my um Dermanitan, I believe. And he's going to for the Isol Momola. I obviously cannot stay in. And he go for the goes for the wish, sorry. And I'm going to pass that out to something which will be his Togekis as I go for a seed player in the off chance of him wanting to stay in or even go to, to his Nero King. Um, it goes for the Togekis, and I'm going to switch out into my Dermanitan. I probably should have stayed in, because he most likely we was going for the Thunder Wave, and I could switch out because I have Natural Cure, and I would be off of my, um, para Paralysis. Yes, um, but I, um, have Heal Bell on my Umbria, so that's not going to be that much big of a deal. Going to my Tornadoes, I tried to go for the Hurricane, unfortunately, I'm going to miss it. Um, it's going to matter a bit, but... Yeah, it's a hurricane. Without the rain, it sucks. Um, I don't want to be paralyzed because I know now I'll be slower. I'm going to my Umbreon and um, trying to go for the Eel Bell because I want to get rid of the paralysis in my um, the, um not our Manitan, but um, oh my God, on um, Tornadoes, me 97, and I'm now going to switch it out into my um Gligary Predict set very really nicely. Goes for the U-turn and gets now the switching advantage. And he's going for his Nero King, and I was like, okay, I can stay in, he, can, he can't do anything to me. But I totally forgot that Nero King gets Ice Beam. I don't know why. I don't know why I forgot. Now I'm going to my Shaman because I know I cannot speed and go for the Earth Power. Choice Packs, super effective. Earth Power, you're not going to live it, sorry. Okay, goes to the Dermanitant. Um, I think he is Scarf, so... Uh, I'm not going to stay in, because he would be able to kill me off with the, um, what should I call it, the Flare Blitz. So I switch out into my Umbreon, and the U-turn does a good chunk of damage into my Umbreon, almost half, and I was like, wow! Now going for the Fake Out, I go for the Protector to take 
out the fake out, take out the fake out. And now I'm just clicking for another protect. <laughs> Fortunately, I hit it. That would be awesome if he had gone for the eye jump kick. But it didn't, and um, you know, E is going for the eye jump kick again. Not again, but yeah, you got it. So, um, my turn, it is a solid to hit KO. I don't know, maybe he was thinking I was scarred, so E switches out and goes into E is all a momola. Fortunately enough, I hit my Hurricane and I get the crit on the Olo Momola. Yeah, it might matter a bit, but yeah, that pays off for the miss I had on this um, Togekis. It's so going for the um, Darmanitan and goes for the Fire Blitz. I was like, maybe he wants to protect me to switch out and goes for the U turn, but that's not the case. He goes right for the Flare Blitz. Now going to my Umbreon, I knew I could resist one and go for the foul play because Darmentan has some really high attack and foul play is stab, so should be able to kill it because Darmentan has like um no defenses at all. Um he's going for his Mian Shao goes for the U-turn. Of course he's going to take out my Umbreon because it is super effective. It's not stab, but it is super effective. And with the attack it has. Um going to my Shaman because it is obviously my last poke and I go for the Seed Flare and I unfortunately don't get a special defense drop well I, sh I wasn't be oh my god I wasn't able to kill him off anyway now I now get through the flinch thing and but on top of that I'm going to miss my Seed Flare not that it matters because I would die anyway so we know he's going to kill me off and yeah that's going to be the game for him so I hope you enjoyed the battle, it was a really cool battle, please go check out Mystical and Kevin Kingdra, please do it, they are awesome guys. Um, yeah, I think that's it for today, but before I leave, I would like to ask you guys something. Um, do you think I should continue on with my LP of Pokemon Black 2? I feel like I want to continue, because I started it, I don't want to um, not finish it, I want to finish it. But, um, no one actually watches it. <laughs> Well, some of you watch it, but I think that you just give a like and you don't even watch it. Sorry if I'm mistaken. But, um, please tell me what I can improve in them, because I know there are lots of guys in YouTube, they do LPs and they, they um, get awesome views, I know they have more subscribers and stuff, but, um, please tell me what do you want me to do with my LP, do you want me to put a layout, do you want me to, um, uh, okay, no, um, yeah, the layout. <laughs> I was going to say for me to choose the, for you to choose choose the Pokemon you wanted me to use, but this is a randomizer, so that's not the case. Um, yeah, just tell me what you think I should uh, improve in my LP. So I'm going to say that until next time. Later.